Okay, I'm gonna be installing a uh, iPod integrated system in uh in my uh, Magnum. All right, it's not too hard. The hardest part is just take taking the courage and taking off the face or the bezel. Um, as you see, there's screws, four screws holding uh, the radio, which I'm gonna be pulling out. All right, uh, you got regular connectors that behind it that you simply press down and pull. This is the most difficult one to take out. You gotta push underneath it with a little tab here and pull out to get to get the bezel off. Alright? Okay, I pulled out the radio. Um, again, the pieces just pull right out. This one here for the antenna was like the most difficult to get out. I mean, you really gotta play with it um, to try to get it out. Alright? Mm. I can show you this. This is the back of the radio, and that's the little antenna and the connections right there. All right, so that's uh everything's out. Now I'm gonna have to remove the uh, glove compartment now. Then again to install. Okay, here's certain things you don't see in the directions. There's like a little, like a little tab that holds the glove compartment right here all right to get it off you're gonna have to come on the other side and it's like a little ring or little hole right there and you're gonna have to push it toward the bigger hole to get this ring off uh, be very careful because you can scratch scratch it so tape up your screwdriver to get it get it off all right now to get it off I think you guys just gotta pull these two tabs up here push them in to slide uh, the glove compartment out all right, I hope it works. All right. <laughs> okay, I got the glove apartment out now. All right. As you can see, there's levels here. All right, one, two, and three. All right, and that coincides with the glove box. There's little levels. One, two, three. So when it folds out, you gotta pull these little tabs that's inside. Right here, one, and there's another one, I don't know, as you can see, hopefully, two. You just gotta push it in, all right? And then the thing will fold out, and just lift up off those tabs. It'll, it'll fold down, and you pretty much have to just lift it up to drop out the glove box. Now, as you can see, in my Magnum, I have the glove box out, and I have the center console out, all right, to install the iPod integrator all right and to do that I'm gonna have to drill behind the glove box when you get the directions you'll see you have to drill a hole right here which I'm gonna do okay now as you see I'm putting in the wires you gotta run it in behind the panel for the iPod and the auxiliary jack it comes with uh, all right, so in pr you pretty much got a lot of room back here. So you pr I'm pretty much probably gonna have to put the existing wires extension in, in the back to get it out of the way. But, uh, it's pretty straightforward. All right, the harness again comes through back here, and this is the harness with, with all the connections. All right, um, so. Let me uh, finish doing that now. Okay, what you should have, you should have your this harness, the big thick harness, up top. This harness here, up top above this this piece here. The little smaller pieces is in the bottom of this again this piece. So you have uh, two connections down here and a big connection up top between these two pieces here. All right, it's kind of again just follow directions. It's going okay. Um, that's pretty much it. There's the the brain. I guess, I guess you can call it the iPod right here. Pretty much going to fit right underneath here. This is they give you some padding to put on it. Two ties goes around here, ties it down, and it's pretty much snug up there. This, the cable's already in. Again. Uh, you have the other fat cable that's coming over it right here. I'm about to tie that down. Start plugging things back up. 
it's pretty straightforward nothing too difficult just yet all right and on the other side coming through the compartment is the, the, the connectors which I'm about to hook up all right um, and that's it right for now all right uh, let me get this going and I'll, I'll sign back on after I you know get it hooked up okay here's the glove box is back in um, see if I could zoom in there's the connection it's pretty much a clean connection once you get that yes yeah, son a little son here um, Bobby. Yeah, yeah. Here's my. Uh, all right, here's my cameo, Bobby, son. Bobby, hey, yeah. Bobby. All right, go. No. All right, let get daddy finish. <coughs> all right, back to this. All right, again. Um, nice clean, clean connection. The wires coming in. Glove part is back in, and back to that little tab I told you about right here. Make sure you get that back in. It's really simple to come out. Right there. You just gotta make sure you slide it back to pop out the compartment. Pretty much come out pretty simple. Is all the cables is in. All right. So that that's insulation's done. All right. Let me continue on. All right. Every, everything's going in pretty back. All right. Going back in. Um, just to let you know, the connectors was holding this the bezel or the face plate. All right. It's just four connectors. Uh, one is here. And one is here, all right. It's a little, I don't know if you can see it, the little pins right here, right there, and another one right there. And there's two in the bottom. Well, one on the side, which is right here, and right there, and there's another one, two in the bottom. And that's where they're being held, all right. All you need is one of these prior tools, you know, you can get it from any place. All right, any home, I mean, um, or the body store, or like an AIDS or what it may be, and just get behind it and pry it out, and it comes right out, real simple. All right, I'm gonna install it and um, put it back. In. Oh, my son is messing up my car. Little boy, cut it out. <laughs> All right, uh, I'll sign back on and see once it's working. Bye. All right, installation is done. Um, Right now, I don't know if you can see it. On my iPod, it's hooked up, and I just noticed. Uh, if you look a little closer, you have the little Chrysler symbol right there on your iPod, showing that it's a uh, a good connection.